A silent voice. With a title like that, I already expect greatness because it's creative. Something Western media severely lacks nowadays. I finally reacted to it. I've been asked about this movie since I started my channel. It's about damn time I get to it. I want you guys to let me know down below. What's your favorite anime movie of all time? Maybe I'll check it out because let me just tell you, not only did I absolutely love this movie, but I connected with it more than I thought I would. If you want the full reaction, make sure you check out my Patreon, the full almost three hour video is up there we discuss it and everything let's uh let's begin <laughs> bro if i start overreacting it's gonna be insane yo it's a fucking mountain holy shit oh shit it's, it's fucking water oh my god is that earth kyoto oh i'm gonna cry oh my god i'm crying already man <laughs> shit You know, this already feels like a movie. The Shape of Voice. What? I get the right, the, the right video. All right, $300, nice. You could get by with that. Oh God, oh fuck. Starting off with a bang, literally. Shit, man. This is Japan. You can tell. There he is, Subaru, right? That's his name, Subaru. Choji? All right, three friends. This is before, so we're about to see us alike. How did it become so depressing? I'm smiling while I can. Yeah, normal life. Playing games, reading manga, I wasn't doing that. Rubber band guns, we're not shooting up schools. We're not using real guns, we're using rubber bands. Remember those times? Good old Japan. Jumping off bridges, playing with beavers, watching black men lift. Dude, if this is in English, I paid $3 for this. This better be in fucking Japanese, I'd even make sure. My heart stopped. So this classmate's gonna be the girl that he falls in love with. Ashida? Ashida. Who's gonna be the bully? Who's gonna piss me off? Because I could already smell it. That's so awkward. Teachers that say introduce yourself? And then touching her? Oh, wait a minute. Oh my god. No! Oh no. Don't make me run in this classroom, bro. They better treat her nice. Please, everybody be nice. You fu- Oh, this bitch is gonna annoy me. She's so sweet. Please treat her nice. Putting him in the walls of Jericho in the middle of class? I've never done this. About a scar- uh, A cho- cho choji for life? Oh god, don't piss me off. Let me your notebook. What are you gonna write in it? She's writing something nice, right? Like a phone number so they can hang out at the school? Oh no, she doesn't know what she sounds like because she's deaf. They're gonna start laughing at her. Don't laugh. This is Japan. We're respectful, right? I'm already feeling it, man. Oh yeah, why would she ask for a phone number? She's deaf, you're right. Why did I even say- Oh god, see, I'm dumb. Bro, they're always like putting each other in headlocks in WWE moves. <laughs> what do you mean you're kidding me? She's deaf! <laughs> Wait, what's he doing? Is he making fun of her? Or is he. No, don't tell me he's making fun of her. Oh, God, don't tell me he's gonna end up like bullying her and then he's gonna f like eventually start to like her and feel terrible for what he's doing. I thought I wouldn't like her. I thought it would be her that I'd have a problem with and want to, you know. Nishimiya. We're nice in this school. Everybody seems nice right now. But this is school, guys. We all know what school, what, what a synonym for school is. OST is so simple. But it tells you what this movie's gonna be. <laughs> Shooting. 
Maybe if this was like American Silent Voice. Who's throwing rocks at her? We throw rocks at the deaf girl? Friend? Oh, I knew it. Oh, God. She was like, me and you, friend. Motherfucker! This is our main character? They're teaching her how to talk with Shoko. Oh, God. The teacher's nice, too. I prefer this teacher over the other creep. Look at him. He thinks this is a K-drama or some shit. Why does he look like that? Why does someone put Aizen in the chat? Yeah, he does look like Aizen. Aww. Come here. Come here! I'd go to jail if I was a teacher, man. I'd fuck the kid up. These kid needs clothes that fit in. Oh, no. No, they're gonna do something to her plant. No. Don't. Brute, it's a beautiful plant. How about we water it together? Oh, my God. What's going on? He's gonna do something dickheaded. Ashita? Ashita. This is why the Kinsey's died. You motherfucker. He's a dick! Do something, teacher! He does look like Subaru! What are you doing? Why are you touching her like that? What's wrong with this bitch? No! Don't let him see! What are you doing? What? 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 I'd spill blood. I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys. I, I don't- I have no remorse. No s- <laughs> Holy shit. Why would you throw that? Who are these kids? <laughs> Who is he showing off for? Oh gosh, she keeps coming into his, his path. I'm sorry. For what? For being nice? This kid's gonna wi wind up, like, falling in love with her or something. Friend. No! Oh, just say yes! The fuck?! Bro, you see that bat that kid has in his hand? I would use that shit and get a triple kill right now. That's what you get! It's what he gets! Oh, she's staying home. You see what happens when you're a dick? Oh my God, man. But the teacher doesn't do anything. He's right there. He should have been. He should have said, "Look at him. He's always looking down." I'd point that fucking finger, bro. I'd, I'd be like six nine. I'd point directly at him. We know it's you. Okay, Aizen. Shit. Like, maybe you should have stopped him then. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> she was the nicest. Damn, the whole class is like baka. Oh my god. She's probably putting on an act. This guy's better have a revelation. Jumping in the water. <laughs> I feel like he hates himself. And he's dealing with it this way. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo! God, man, so much, so quick. It's like, I know I'm gonna feel for both characters by the end of the film. I kind of get what's going on right now. The parallels. Ashida, what he's dealing with in, in his life. Turning into anger. Looking at show like that, mom and everything. It's like imagine you getting bullied, 
you don't come to class and then not coming to class turns into not going to school and changing schools. And then they're gonna obviously run into each other again. Oh my god, man. And then like reliving this like from childhood to now like teenage life and stuff. Like reconnecting again. Again. You remember me? When we changed schools, you remember me? Oh my god. Now he's nice because he's grown into his like emotions more i'd run away too at the how he treated me you remember me i i fucking scarred you for life i made you switch schools remember me at least he's more grown up now doesn't look like a piece of shit now he's blushing oh god he learned it so he's grown he's learned in sign language oh my god don't say W with Sheeta. Don't say W with Sheeta. You could say he was just a piece of shit kid. But I wasn't like that when I was a kid. Like now you would think it's nice. Oh, they're in high school, you know. He's coming to his emotions more. He's not a piece of shit anymore. Nah, bro. This is high school. You thought elementary was bad? Ho ho. Welcome to the real hell. Like, I understand. This is my first pause, all right? This is my first pause. All right? We're going to be pausing so we can talk so I don't talk over the movie all of the time. But, like, could you really excuse him for the way he acted because of his upbringing? Because of where he's from and what he's been through? Like, oh, that's an excuse. Because of that, he could be this way. I think it's different because when you're a child, you're not fully functional in your brain yet. And your feelings, right? It's no excuse. I wasn't like that. Maybe because I don't come from like a crazy fucking childhood. Who knows? Maybe I would have been a piece of shit if I came from a destructive family. If I came from no family. If I came from one parent. An abusive parent. A, a, a parent that was an addict or whatever. Maybe it would be different. I don't know. I can't speak for that. But I don't see an excuse for that. I feel like you reap what you sow. Would he do that when he was older? Probably not. We're seeing that. We're seeing him. Now he's like a teenager. I think. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, he's more like a teenager now reconnected with the girl that he bullied when he was a child he's more in tune with his emotions and now he's able to function better and not be a piece of shit and not blame everything on his past and his life and everything you know i feel like it's terrible if you just excuse him oh he was a kid no bro kids do some fucked up shit i'm sure a lot of you could agree i'm sure when we were kids y'all or when y'all were kids you were bullied you gave them excuses Oh, yeah, I mean, they were fatherless, so um, it was all right for them to, 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 to make me eat my shit. You know what? No, no. Fuck that. Maybe there was a reason they were fatherless, and they fucking deserved it. In front of the baby, man. Nah, this is... Mom! It was part of the ritual that reminded him. Bro, the parallels and shit, it's insane. They showed him jumping off a bridge with his friends and then- Oh, just become friends with her, please. Please. It'll make you love yourself. Fuck! What a piece of shit. People watching it were just as deserving of that what shit. The friends weren't a piece of shit for like not def like like holding them accountable, but like for just watching it. And then when shit hits the fan, they're like, oh yeah yeah fuck him. You know what I mean? Like they they they, they were always on his side until that happened, and that's like fuck him. You know what I mean? Like I don't I don't like that at all. It it would be different if. They were against it while it was happening, but they were just watching and laughing and smiling with his fucking oversized clothes, looking like an idiot like this. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, no, no, they were pieces of shit just like him. Welcome to high school. Hell school. Everybody knows he's the bully now. Don't talk to Ishida. Now he's gonna hate himself. He already tried killing himself, but he's the only one that could evolve out of his situation. 
Look, the teacher doesn't matter. They're like, they should do this in anime more often. Show the characters don't mean anything. Just X them out. But I know what they're showing right now. I know they're not showing us that they're meaningless. I know what they're telling us. Now, now he's getting his karma. And now you get to feel terrible for him. What is, what's in there, a bomb? Shh, dude, this hits home too much. Like, y'all think, um, like this outgoing person, bro. I was fucking bullied. Middle school, high school. High school was it, man. This is where this shit's gonna hit me. This shit's gonna hit me so fucking hard, man. I'm gonna relate with this a lot. I wasn't a bully when I was in elementary school. I was never a bully. I was always a nice guy, right? I was always nice. I was. I always treated everybody nice. High school, I was just bullied. So I'm a Sheeta, but I was never a, a piece of shitta. You know what? I was never a shitta. I was a Sheeta without the Ashita. I was a good kid. He, sure he doesn't deserve it. I don't think anybody deserves it. Like saying he deserves it now, it's like that's how it's never going to end. You know what I mean? Like saying somebody deserves it means you're just allowing it to happen again. I feel like we just need to stop it entirely, man. Don't treat a piece of shit like a piece of shit. Like, don't be a piece of shit yourself. You're just repeating the cycle. What's he even living for? Oh my god. Like, this is why shit happens. Like, you know what I mean? You are a phony fuck. He didn't mean that. Look at that. Look at that. He loves that shit. He just doesn't want to associate himself with the guy that everybody hates right now. You know what, man? Cause the rumbling. I don't blame you. Look, guys, it's uh, it's Lizzo. Is that Shoji? Is that Choji? Choji! Oh wait, no. It's a lunch lady. He has to learn to forgive himself. He made a he made a problem. Apologize. Exactly. Look, Panda Man. Fucking Panda Man. You see, I even spot him in different animes. Look how simple Japan is. Until you get into the schools. Can I borrow your bike? All right, go get your own fucking bike. There's a million of them. Now he's getting bullied. Now he's gonna watch it. Come on, fix your problem. Go help him. It's always the fat kid they pick on. I was the fat kid. Please go help him. Ashita, take your bow out. Come on. Don't walk away. What are you doing? Look at this prick! That was so nice of him. See? He's atoning for his sins. No, don't take those signs. Fluffy new bread coupon? Buy her a piece of- buy her a loaf of bread. Oh! He's gonna bring bread to her because she feeds the fish! Remember when Inoue had the loaf of bread? Bro, I'm a genius. I hate gatekeepers. Cock blockers. He buys her a loaf of bread, but he needed a coupon for it. Just a rat. I think she she genuinely wants to be his friend. Everyone's keeping them away from each other until it's too late. Yeah, feed them. Damn, bro, the fucking fish is gonna choke to death. Bro, is a car about to send him flying? God, I thought I don't know, the camera angle was weird, man. Uh... <laughs> yeah! This is like an entirely different person from when he was when he was a kid. He's sharing his loaf. His first friend. Everyone else is X'd out. I would really X them out. We're going to the movie theater. What are we watching? Nobody's here. What is it? The Marvels? <laughs> That's literally gonna be me soon. His first true friend until he becomes a fucking bully. Until he loses weight, gets ahead of himself, and he starts bullying others. <laughs> This is so nice. Some, something fucking dark is gonna happen. Someone said they're watching Black Clover. <laughs> you motherfucker. What'd you mean by that? I looked at chat for one minute and that's what I see. What gives you the right to have friends? Oh my god, like the way he looks at friendship is insane. But at least he values it. 
<laughs> Do it. Give him the rub. Nice. Yeah! Let's go! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> I really hope this kid stays this way. She's not here. She's right there, you idiot! I'm dating Shoko. Hit him with the bread. Jesus Christ, this little bastard thinks he's so smart. Yeah! Now that's a friend. Throw him! Wait, that's a boy? No, 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 no. Bro, he kind of looks like Broccoli, his friend. <laughs> Why did I feel like she was just about to say Subaru? Nobody else matters. Come on, go to the bridge. He literally looks like a piece of Broccoli. Now they're friends. Aww. He's doing his sign language. Beautiful, man. Jiraiya over here. Their friendship is gonna happen, and then something devastating is gonna happen. She's gonna get a bullet in her head or something, and I'm not ready for it. Don't, don't. Now he's really gonna jump the bridge. I, oh, wait, is she? What are you? My God! These kids are crazy, man. Oh, it's foreshadowing. Fuck! They're foreshadowing the next bridge. It's not gonna be that small. What a beautiful shot. Y'all ever heard of a fishing rod? Damn! I'm sorry. Watch. Watch, ready? Sumi Mazen. Oh no, she can't talk. Fuck, man, what's wrong with me? Peace out? <laughs> Did she just say peace out? <laughs> Damn, that's a nice tweet. Showing a kid jumping off the bridge. Bye. I'm about to tweet that. Oh god, the school's gonna see it. What? What about it? What about it? What a bunch of fuckheads, man. Huh? What kind of angle is that? Oh, it's his sister? We don't know what her, her face looks like? It's like the Powerpuff Girl adults. We don't see what they look like. He feels like he deserves it. He's accepting like all the punishment that comes his way. Like every bad thing that happens to him, he's so willing to accept it now because of how much of a piece of shit he was when he was a child. Oh, damn, that kid is fucking small, man. I'm back to that. Oh, I thought it was a fucking funeral, man. Holy shit. Life is finally going right. We're living good. Another hour left. I'm sure it's wholesome. Take the fucking umbrella. Look, man, he's making up for being a piece of shit. He's good now. I forgive him. Oh, shit. I mean, this kid has a point. I, yeah. I mean, a little too brutal about it. I think he's genuinely a good guy right now, trying to make up for what he did in the past. But not everyone has to forgive him so easily. Of course she did. She wanted to be his friend. I'm not her boyfriend. I'm her brother. Brother. Oh. Dakara? I'm her pinky finger. Didn't I say it wasn't a dude? I was like, was this a dude? Then I kept making it fun. I kept saying it's his brother. Oh my god. Stay away from my daughter. 
Holy shit. Bro, her mother is out for fucking blood. I would not blame her, honestly. I'm not blaming her. That would be me if I was her mother. Stay away. I knew it. I knew she would say that. Stay away. Wait till the mother finds her and Ashita hanging out. Look, already hanging out with him. This kid is a boss now, man. To call me some- I mean, text me sometime, bro. What's wrong with me? <laughs> Sahara. Oh, God. Flashbacks of when they weren't kids and- Oh, fuck! Am I wrong for not trusting her? そんなにいらないよ。気にすんなよ。ミスターマニーバッグオブヒ。お食事代、ラブホ代と考えたら、これくらいあった方が安心だ。ダーン。連れてきたぞ。I brought her. Why didn't I have a friend like this in school? Come on, come on, next, next. Let's work together today. Oh, God! So cute! I don't know, man. If I was deaf and the world treated me like this, I, I, I would not be that nice. Oh, look, it's Sahara Desert! I remember you. Wow, look, look at her now, bro. God, I love how her friends learned how to do sign language like this. And they actually kept at it, and they wanted to learn it. Here we go. Here we go. Let's find out. No! no! We're, we're watching a wholesome movie, alright? This ain't a normal Nicholas Light stream. Let's take a look. Holy shit. I bet a bunch of y'all got excited. Fucking creeps! Here, have a coupon. That bitch, I know who I remember those eyes. I remember you working on the street now, you deserve it! She's a cat girl now. She's a fucking furry. The Meow Meow Club. Look how her life's become. Oh! It went karaoke! Sahara! Oh god. Don't reunite them! I want to reunite them with this! <laughs> Wait, she might actually be nice now. Maybe she had a revelation. Uh, that's not her, bro. It's the Clark Kent. The glasses. You can't tell it's her? I never went to a cat... ...cafe. I went to an otter cafe. Oh no, what are they telling her? That it's never coming back? That it's gonna get worse and that it's becoming deadly or something? No. Oh, I can't read Whoa. lips. Oh, she's depressed hearing what she heard. She took it out and... Everything was going so nice. Back to the f turmoil. Yeah, it is her. Have you go apologize? She's still all alone? What the fuck? Wait till she finds out she just hanging out with her. You gonna get jealous? Bitch. She's still the same. She hasn't grown. Get off. <laughs> the seat's reserved. <laughs> She's still a bitch! Push her in the middle of the street, please. Push her in the middle of the fucking street! If there was a highway behind the man, I'd put it to use. We need truck coon. But can somebody get truck coon on the phone? I need a whole a league of truck coons. I need, I, I need all of them. All of them to come. All of them. Get, 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 gather the, the truck coon squad. Oh my god. I hope you live the rest of your life in that fucking cat cafe. Right back to work to put her tail on. Aww. Now he's protecting her. 
Some kids never change. Oh, God. Oh, she's so cute, man. Better come. Oh. <laughs> oh, God. Get out of high school. Graduate already, man. Fuck these kids. That sounds terrible out of context. You know what I mean. Don't feel embarrassed. Let her be her. No. Right back to his roots. Dajobu. 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 Let her talk. She's so cute, man. Ah, shit, that's so cute the way she talks. Arigato. Arigato. Oh no. Massive fumble. Oh god. Why are boys so dumb? Bag! Where's Killer when we need him to say bag? Oh god. <laughs> How many of y'all have done that in your life? Shit. I told the Sheena I like him. <laughs> oh, this is so fucking cute. Oh god, she's gonna fucking die, man. This is the one time I hope this isn't like an anime. You know why she changed it? She takes all glasses off. She thinks she's special now. Bitch! What a bitch. No! I don't trust Mashiba. Put that X back on his head. Where's Nishimiya? No, her stomach hurt. No! No! Is she gonna... The moon. The moon! The moon! Is she gonna see all this? And, and be, be affected some way? And this fucking bitch with her glasses off is gonna do something? I'm going out with some people wanna come. Oh no, this is gonna be trouble. Oh god. Look at her kicking her feet, man. She's so cute. No! I wasn't deaf, but I could relate with her. Oh god, this is where hell is happening. Son of a bitch. How about we put her on top of the ride and throw her off? Wearing Mikasa scarf. Who is she? Yeah, 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 yeah. She's acting similar. Motherfucker. I hope Final Destination happens on this ride. We're without the characters we like. Hoping for a malfunction. Wow. A lot of people have to change the way they look at things. She was about to stand up and said, don't stand up. And, and the way the camera was panning and shit, man, I was worried. Come on, Ishida! Look, she still has an X on her head, that bitch. I have sign language too for you. Oh, God. He's realizing something. Hold on. Put that X back on. This is the first time he's had fun in the fucking show, I think. I like you. I want to. How about you go get it yourself? How about you go join the octopus? Why is she here? This is where he belongs for the rest of his fucking life. Oh god, it's hitting him again. Now he's gonna start blaming himself right when he was having fun. Now he's reminded of the PTSD. Right back on it. He was finally accepting life. 
and happiness and fun and forgiving himself and now it's right back to normal oh my god i thought someone was sitting there with their fucking head off holy shit man i got scared for a second tell me not like i was looking at this i'm like what the fuck so i was watching attack on titan for a second Jesus Christ, all right, all right, boo hoo! Bro, why is she here? I do. Nicholas does. Yeah, go on the fucking Ferris wheel. I hope what happened in the death movie happens here. What the fuck? What's gonna what? This is the one time I'll reference the Death Note movie. Never expect that again. I would stab her with that pen, send her off the fucking Ferris wheel. God. This is someone that's beyond redemption. They're pieces of shit now and forever. That was the sign for you? Oh, God. Get over it. Go back to your fucking cat cafe and meow for your customers. Damn, man. Yo, let's go to her cat cafe and jump her. What do you guys say? Let's have peace between us. No, she doesn't hate you. She's a nice person, unlike you. You motherfucker. She got beaten in the Ferris wheel. Oh my god. You just let them get off? If I worked at that Ferris wheel, I'd lock her in there and just keep it going forever. Oh god, only if you do. What do you mean by that? This bitch took the glasses off and look what she's become. Telling everybody all of this. Look at her now, she's playing the victim. Boo hoo! Throw her on the fucking Ferris wheel, too. Put your glasses back on. Damn, man. Yeah! What? I don't know who I hate more, you and O or her? Oh, God. Nagasuka is still there for him. I feel terrible for him, man. He's the only one that learned and has grown and is making up for all the bad shit he's done. Like, yeah, he did something bad, but if the person he did it bad to is willing to forgive him and move on and grow, then why the fuck else is everyone else being a bitch? Like, I understand if she didn't want to, like, be friends with him, but she likes him. She loves him! Now he's gonna beat himself up over this shit, man. Please stay with these three. Go in a truck and a truck and just move on. Oh my god, I'd get twin glocks. Bro, it's like everyone's getting involved in this shit, man. Just let the two be. Let that like everybody's trying to like self-insert themselves. Fucking children. I'm getting mad. God, can, can we just throw her overboard, please? Both of them. I didn't bully her like you did. You still did. Why is now here? <laughs> Shut up! Playing victim. Piece of shit. Pathetic. Even a bird knows it. Look at him, just taking a seat, man. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. No, man. They're making it your fault. No, no, say it like that. You're the only one I like, Nagasuka. You go home, bitch. Go cry about it. Hit the bricks. Yeah, see you later. Run away like you always did.
Go back home. Sorry. You're the sorry one. You shouldn't you shouldn't have come. You should have stayed out of the picture. I don't even know who you are! <laughs> exactly! Get out! I actually feel bad for him, man. I mean, he's just there. Guy was just literally there. Is she crying? There's one fish left. Symbolism. Foreshadowing. Bro went off. <laughs> one one? Yo, grandma got swag, man. Damn. W, Grandma. Aww. Damn. Damn. Grandma is a walking W. When Ma in the chat. Look at the calendar, doggies. She loves dogs. Eat your manju. <laughs> Aww. What the fuck, man? Why did they do that? The dead bird wasn't enough? Oh my god, she's not gonna be there. Oh my god, oh no. Oh, oh, she's not coming today or tomorrow. Oh, fuck. No! What happened to Grandma? Why is she crying? Did Grandma not wake up? Yeah, where the fuck is she? What are you hiding, Yuzu? Spit it out! It's okay, she's old. I'm fine with that. Now, I'm not fine with it, but it's life, all right? But, but I was just calling her Wandama. I was just saying W in the chat for Grandma. At least she got one last W, all right? We, she went out with a W, that's all that matters. <laughs> Imagine it just transitioned to that after she went to sleep. I don't know how I would act. They've done that once before with an anime. I forgot what it was. Now Yuzu has to live with a fucking mom that yells at her all day. That's the grandma reincarnated as a butterfly in another world. Now she's going to the Soul Society. Oh my God, man, this is not. Uh, this ain't the time for jokes. This is sad. Oh God. The trauma begins. I mean, trauma began when the fucking movie started. Summer vacation. What a great way to start summer with a dead grandmother. Welcome to summer. What'd I say? What does summer spell? Sadness. Damn. Come on, grab him. He's gonna die. Oh. Baby, uh, <laughs> What was that? What kind of transition was that, man? I'm getting so scared. I just make bad things happen to you? Now she's blaming herself, like him. Oh, God. He keeps mentioning tomorrow. We got plans. Let's bring it together. Let's bring him with us. <laughs> oh, she has the party hat on. She might kill you. How about you tell Mama he's the best thing right now? Ah, come on! I want the fucking mom to smile, man. Smile! It's great. <laughs> you know what I'll say since y'all saying it. The mom is pretty hot. There's a fireworks display. 
That's gonna be beautiful for her to see, but she can't hear the fireworks. Like, she just gets to see, she doesn't have to hear the ba, 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 ba. She, she doesn't have to hear all that. Look, we're a family now. Uh, I would love to look at fireworks without hearing them. We're all looking at it, everybody. Even a guy that doesn't matter at all. Those are some real ass fireworks, man. Damn. It's like we're finally getting a fucking happy ending, man. The mom's a little happy accepting of Subaru. Wow, we're growing. Please, man, yes. I feel like there's gonna be like a time jump. Either a time jump or a jump. Look at her, she's finally having a good time. You don't have these dickheads in class ruining them for their time. This is how it should be. I want to tuck in his tag so bad, man. I want him to walk, to, to look at it like she is, like put headphones on or something. She's leaving? No, no, the, the shitter? She's hungry. Studying. Say the time to study? What the fuck? What the fuck? Man, I was ready. I was ready. Oh. That went worse than I thought. Oh my god. That went way worse than I thought. Nishimiya-san. Ano, Nishimiya-san, gomen nasai. Kitto, musuko ga mata, Shouko-san ni nani ka shita n desu. Janaki, ano. Oba-san, Ishida wa uchi no baka ne-chan o taskete kureta n desu. Yegeki no heroin bunten ja ne-e ga! Hanka iye yo, da omoi agari na da yo! <laughs> Yo, she slaps everyone, man. you guys for showing me this wow the past like 10 minutes man the, the whole movie i gotta see him i gotta see what he looks like man i thought this would end in death i'm surprised he's still alive i'm shocked there's still time though but i don't is she gonna start blaming herself everything bad that happens to you is because of me she was blaming herself and now look at him he's in the hospital Brought the flowers. T nah, man, nah. Shit. She's gonna start blaming herself like he blamed himself his whole life. Thank God you have a friend like Broccoli Head. Oh, God, man. He's crying, man. I think that made me the most emotional. <laughs> Seeing him crying like that. Maybe now people will change. 
Maybe now we'll learn? You didn't break anything. You fixed him. Literally fixed him. Oh, now this... My friends, this is a masterpiece. Oh my god. That this went like the best possible route it could have went with its story. I think I use that term too much now because this is what a masterpiece looks like, bro. I ain't feeling bad for her. You can hold 10 umbrellas. Up. Fish isn't even there. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Checking to see if he's real. <laughs> I'm real. Oh God, I don't, I don't like seeing her cry, man. I'm glad you're safe. Oh fuck, man. She's still blaming herself, man. They're con like both of them are taking accountability for stuff. She's blaming herself. He was blaming himself. Ah yes. Mm. It couldn't have been said better, man. <laughs> oh, yes. Woo. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Fucking perfect. It's a perfect story. God, man. Like, dude, dude, dude. Like, I'm in just, like, <laughs> I'm in disbelief. Honestly, like, it takes a lot for me not to talk in my videos. You know, like, I constantly want to say something whenever I'm reacting to something. Like, oh, I got to entertain and shit. But nah, with this, I was just trapped in it. Like, internally, just, like, wondering what's going to happen next. Like, him... Saving her from jumping and then him being the one taking the fault. It's like him in his entire life his entire life taking the fault blaming himself and she's blaming herself and Then it's reversed. It's oh god. It's like the story is about him Coming to terms with what he did and just like le learning to fucking love himself, man That's what I feel like it's about him loving himself it's not about, like, the others and stuff, man. I still hate the people that, that, the fucking fuckheads. I still hate them. Oh, the $3 was worth it, bro. This was $3. <laughs> oh, shit. Should be way more than that. Whew, God. This story could have not been better than the route they went. Oh, no, I still hate you. I don't give a damn what she did. I ain't thanking her. Piece of shit. Threatened her. Made, like, fucking bullied her. You are! On the Ferris wheel. I don't give a damn, man. This character's beyond redemption. She's one of them. He told me not to tell you. Welcome back. Yeah, the X remains on you. Sayonada, bitcho! I never want to see them together again. Get out of here. No, 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 no. Put that, I'm taking that shit off the floor and slapping her with it. That shit's a tattoo on her. Wait a minute. Oh, oh my god! No! The moms are like friends now, man. What the fuck? That's beautiful. Oh god. <laughs> Them two together is like my favorite part, man. Oh my god. Like, look. look. I have a hit list, right? I have a list of people I wanna. She's not on it. 
<laughs> she's on the list of people I really fucking love in this movie, man. Someone said that was Onion Capone. Are you serious? I'm never looking at fireworks the same after this movie. Now we're taking pictures of things that are alive instead of fucking dead. Bro, imagine this is all a dream. Like he's still in that fucking hospital yes. bed. Nah, that would be too much. Because this is all too good to be true, to be honest with you guys. The movie's gonna end with him in the hospital bed. That's when I put myself in a fucking hospital bed. I swear to God, man, they better not do that to me. Oof. Another beautiful shot. This whole movie is full of wallpaper shots, man. I feel like there's one more devastating blow to hit. They better stick together to the end. I don't believe in love if they don't. No! Oh, man. You ever just hug your friend in the bathroom stall, man? Oh, shit. Woo! <laughs> Never leave me again. It's his first friend, his best friend, man. Must. <laughs> I didn't even realize that. I thought it was like an animated thing. Give it to him! <laughs> I still don't like it. Mashiba's still here? Bro, I didn't even know he was there. I still don't like these people. Slap her! She should have been the one that jumped. You're a baka! Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> baka! <laughs> oh, shit! Baka! That's all you need to know what they say! Baka! <laughs> uh, maybe, maybe there's redemption. Maybe we're getting better. First step to being a better person. She had her whole fucking life to be better. He's deciding to be free. Chiyuda! Now he's finally learning to live with himself, to accept the world. All the exes are gonna come off. Oh my god. Yes! Yada! We can finally hear! He's the one that's been deaf. That guy has to change his clothes since we saw him for the first time. Woo! Got you, let's go! From wanting to kill himself to wanting to live. Finally finding the, the value of life. It's like the beginning of a movie. I gotta start reevaluating what I call masterpieces because that was one, if not <laughs> the masterpiece. <laughs> Holy shit. Dude, 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 dude. My favorite animated movie of all time is, is fucking Inside Out, the Disney movie. This blows that out of the water. Listen, man, what are y'all rating this? 10 out of 10 or, or a 10? How I perceive this movie. It's just, it's about like a, a journey of, of learning how to love yourself, how to move on. You know, he could have easily have, like he could have easily have grown and not evolve. You could grow, but not grow inside of here or inside of here. He grew inside of here and inside of here and he got bigger too. He got long, like his legs got longer and shit. It's like an eternal growth. Unlike the other characters that remained a piece of shit until the end. I don't forgive them. UNO, fuck that bitch. I don't, I don't trust her. I don't like her. The girl with the glasses, Velma. Fuck her too. And then Mishido, which is there. I have no opinion on him. But they don't grow. They stay the same forever. Maybe the coward. She, she could get better throughout life. He was a piece of shit in the beginning. I was gonna call him Subaru again. Yeah. He was a piece of shit in the beginning. Because of his life circumstances because of reality what he's been through his family and everything and all of that so he was taken out on the world because of that he was angry at himself he was angry from within from the very beginning and after elementary school he was able to grow he was able to look within 
but then he started blaming himself. He wanted to kill himself. He um, refused to look at anybody, refused to hear anybody. And then he just, he learns. Being with Shoku, being with her, with Yusu, for finding the, the, her, his friend, one of the greatest friends I've seen in anime, in media. Yeah, fuck the teacher in the beginning. I feel like a silent voice, it's like you, you, you're showing this character that's deaf, but she's not the only one that's deaf. It's also him. They're both deaf. Both main characters are deaf in different ways. Like, she's actually deaf, but he's deaf to just his surroundings. You know, it's like it's, it, it's, like, it's a double entendre, man. It's insane. But I love his growth at the end, the, the mother and everything, man. Damn. Really good. Really good shit. That was fucking amazing. I gotta watch um your name. I'm gonna watch that with Liv. Yeah, we're gonna watch it together. Broccoli head carried. Yeah, broccoli head was like the best man from the second we saw him. God tried to steal his bike. Bagga. Fuck that. Her learning how to say bagga. <laughs> Hell yeah. This really hit home. But like you know, I wasn't a bully when I was in elementary school. I was never a bully. You can say I'm a bully now when it comes to anime kids. But I was never a bully, so I don't have that perspective of having a bad youth. So I let that determine who I am as a person, taking it out on the world. I never did that. I had, like, more of an internalized battle where I would always blame myself. So I could, I could understand from that perspective. But I was never a bully. But I went on a journey of evolution. Of becoming a better person. I wasn't always the beautiful man you see in front of you right now. I had my demons. I've done shit. I fucking killed people. No, I, I never did that. I never did that. But I, I, I've made mistakes. We've all made mistakes. I've made mistakes I'm not proud of. But I didn't let it define who I was. I've grown. I grew. I grew. I had to forgive myself for the bad shit. And I don't care. It's not your place to forgive you. Oh, fuck that, bro. It's my life. Forgive yourselves. Move on. Just move on. I thought it would end and we'd find out that he he was dead. You know, or he was in a coma the whole time. I did not see that switch up happening, man. I thought she was literally going to die. When she jumped off, I thought her body was going to be like this on the floor on the cement. Thank God. It, 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 was, it, was, it was foreshadowing. Era, era, era. I don't know what I just did there. It was foreshadowing. Earlier, when, when they were together and, and he fell down that little hill and she didn't catch him. But then he caught her. There was a lot of fucking foreshadowing in this film, man. A lot. Shit! With the dead animals, the fish, like constantly showing the fish at the bridge with the bread and how like one of them was there. It's a movie that I want to watch again. It's really hard for me to watch a movie for the first time and really be hit how you're supposed to be hit. Like, you probably go to other reactions, people crying their eyes out. Me, is different. Like, if I'm too focused, my emotion right there is focused. If I cry, it's gonna take me off, my focus. But I'm so into it. That I'm constantly asking questions. I'm constantly engaged with it. I've cried on camera a few times. But I have to be, I don't know, it has to be very, like, if I'm being told, oh, you're going to cry. Then I'm not going to cry. It's that type of thing, you know what I mean? It's like when someone tells you a joke, they're like, oh, this, you're going to die laughing at this. It would have, you would have actually probably died laughing at it if they didn't tell you to die laughing at it. You know what I mean? But when everybody's telling you, it's sad. You're going into it knowing something sad's gonna happen. And it, the, the emotion's not gonna come to you naturally. Are you trying to tell me that Baby Boss won the, the Oscar and this didn't? Don't tell me Baby Boss won. What are you talking about? What? What? Baby Boss! The fucking baby with a, with a, with a, with a tuxedo on! You ever ask someone, uh, anyone ever ask you why do you hate America? Just tell them because Baby Boss beat a silent voice. <laughs>